From Buchanan County Commissioner to the Secretary of State's office, St. Joseph's Harry Roberts has had a busy last few years in public service, but now he's taking on a new role, making sure the state's military interests are represented both in Jefferson City and in Washington. One of the biggest industries in the state of Missouri is the military. Its installations and private industry partners making an $18 billion yearly impact to the state's economy. That's a big investment worth protecting. We obviously want to make sure that we don't lose any missions, any bases, any military personnel, any, any uh, business partners uh, that serve. Enter former Buchanan County Commissioner Harry Roberts, who is now Missouri's new military advocate, a position created in 2016. A lot of it came out of the fact that uh, during BRAC and, and uh, there's great concern, as there, as there would be, um, for losing bases, missions, different things like that. Roberts was appointed to the position by Governor Mike Parson to a six-year term. Roberts is currently touring the state's facilities, meeting with each of the commanders to hear of their needs and concerns, and Roberts with a lofty goal to meet. In the governor's words, Missouri, the most military and veteran-friendly state in the nation. The military's presence in Missouri, stretching from St. Joseph's very own 139th Air Guard Base to Fort Leonard Wood, to Whiteman Air Force Base, over to St. Louis and the Military Entrance Process Command. In his role, Roberts will deal with the bureaucratic work of protecting the state's military interests so the base's commanders can do their jobs. You know, there's always the concern of, uh, of uh, downsizing and things of that nature, uh, and, you know, we don't want to be victim of that. And with Harry taking some of that sort of stuff uh, off of my plate and allowing me to focus more on things that uh, running this wing, that, that, that helps a lot. And Robert says he's humbled by serving in his position of military advocate. The people who serve in the military, they voluntarily put on that uniform. They're the greatest people there are. They guarantee that you and I are going to be safe at night and we can live in this country that we call the United States of America, where we can, we can understand what liberty is. Robert's role also includes advocating for veterans and their families. St. Joseph's R.T. Turner, one of 11 members on the Missouri Preparedness and Enhancement Commission, which helps to oversee the Office of the Missouri Military Advocate.